actually can't get over this. I'm so obsessed with it. I feel like a little Greek goddess. Okay, angel goddess. Hey guys, it's Emily Das, and welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm sponsored by Asimi Jewelry. If you haven't heard of their brand, here it is. Make sure to go check them out. Also, do have a discount code. This is a discount code here. Let me just mention this video is going to be based on just accessories and jewelry. What I'm going to be doing is I have some outfits here and I'm going to be like styling outfits according to places that you guys put on my Instagram story that you wanted to go. So for the chance to be featured in my YouTube videos, you should go follow my Instagram because a lot of my ideas for my YouTube videos do come from my Instagram. I just want to mention that Asami Jewelry also donates a dollar from every purchase to Beyond Blue Mental Health. So if you are purchasing from them, you're also raising money to a good cause, I guess. So yeah, make sure to go support your small businesses out, which is what I love doing as well. But anyways, without further ado, let's get right on into the video. Okay, for the first outfit we're going to be styling is to the mall. Let me just say, I love spending my money on clothes and food. I literally, every time I go to the shops, money. I don't remember the last time I bought to the shops where I haven't bought something. It's really bad. It's probably an obsession, an addiction. Who knows? But anyways, they're going to be styling an outfit to that. So I have two outfits in mind for this one. I'm pretty sure this is the only category where I chose two outfits because I couldn't pick between these two. I was obsessed with both. So I'm going to be showing you guys both of these outfits. Okay, so this one's going to be super simple. It's a black graphic tee and it has some sunnies. These sunnies are from Yes Style and this tee is from Brandy Melville. I'll try and leave the link in the description for all of it. I also do have a discount code for Yes Style. It's Emily Das that will also be in the description. So this is a top half to this set. And then for our bottoms, we have some blue distressed jeans. They have some rips in them. These are from Princess Polly. Um, yeah, these ones are super cute. I love the fit of them. They're like a little bit baggy, similar to these, I guess, but these ones are skinny jeans, whereas these ones are loose fitting, which is super in trend at the moment. And I think pairing it with the graphic tee would look super cute. So I'm going to try that on and then I'll show you the jewelry that I'm going to be pairing with it. So let's get on into trying that one on. Okay, so this is the first outfit for the mall. It is super cute. I'll try and get a full body shot of it in a minute so you can see all the jeans and the shoes, like all of it together, I guess. But let me just get into the jewelry first. So first off, we have this butterfly necklace. It is super cute. I've seen it on Instagram a lot. And I also got this custom necklace, which is this one at the top that just has my boyfriend's name on it. And it has a little diamond there. And you can get it in different fonts as well, but I just like this font the best. I love the fact that you can get custom jewelry because it always makes it so much like more sentimental, I guess, and personal. The next piece of jewelry I got was this silver bracelet. This one is also customized. has like a little knot at the front. And then it has these little charms. Hold on. I need to try and get it. But then it has an R on it for my boyfriend. And then an A for me, which is super cute because it's so customized and I love it. And it's super cute. And then I also got this ring. Oh my god, the amount of disappointment I have in myself right now. I just spent like maybe 10 minutes trying to look for the ring because I was like, I swear to god I had it on and I was like, where is it? To find out, it was in my hair from when I tied my hair up. It like got caught in my hair. But anyways, I put it back in the little box it came in so I can show you their packaging as well. But this is what it looks like. It's my star sign, so it's an Aquarius. And it's just got like this little pattern and it's in diamonds. I'm going to try and get it to focus. How stunning is that? I'm so obsessed with that. I'm going to put it on so you can, I guess, kind of see it with the outfit. I normally just wear it on my middle finger because I know it fits the best on there. But they are adjustable. That's why I got caught in my hair. But anyways, let me get a better angle so you can see the full outfit. Okay, this angle is trash, but it's the best I can get for a full body shot. So this is what it looks like. I'm so sorry my head's cut off. But anyways, you can see the full outfit. You can get the idea of it. It's super cute. The jeans have shrunk a little bit because I put them in the dryer like way too many times. But anyways, it's super cute. This is what the back looks like. Honestly, love it. I haven't really styled an outfit like this, but I'm going to start wearing this a bit more. Except it's coming in the summer, so it's probably too hot for jeans. But anyways, this is what it looks like, and let's get on to our second outfit for the mall. 
Okay, so this is our second outfit for the mall. I just want to quickly mention, I forgot in the last one I was wearing these gold hoop earrings with the pearls. They were also from that brand. And I'm just wearing the same necklaces and same ring. I also was wearing their green velvet scrunchie, which they sent as like a free add-in. I feel like that's super cute. But I've just paired this white tennis skirt from Yesstar with this black crop top that ties at the back. This top is from Zuffle. I then just paired it with some white Jordans. I feel like it would look super cute with the black and white ones. I don't have those. Wish I did. Here's a photo of them. But anyways, I feel like it would be super cute with those. So anyways, let's get on into our next place. Okay, so our next place is Greece. I haven't actually been to Greece. So I did some research, had a look at about what it's about. And I picked an outfit as best as I could to that place. So let me show you guys what that looks like. So first off, I have this white long sleeve that's cropped, it's from Princess Polly, it's got some raw cutting, which I love because I feel like that's super in trend at the moment. It's super cute, really thin, but it also like does keep you warm, so I really like that about this top. I decided to pair it with the same loose fitting ripped jeans that I paired with the first outfit because I feel like it goes cute together. Then I'm just going to pair it with some Jordans and some accessories, so let's try this one on now. Okay, so this is my outfit for Greece. Just imagine I have it with Jordans. I was too lazy to put them on. I've been taking them off and putting them on way too many times that I cannot be bothered to do that again. But anyways, I paired it with the distressed jeans that I got from Princess Polly. Then we have it with this Brandy Melville chain belt. I guess it's not really a belt, it's kind of like an accessory. And then I have this white long sleeve, which is also from Princess Polly. And then for my hair, I just put like a little clip at the back. And just put it back a little bit. I guess it makes it look neater than just having it down. But yeah, then I also have my jewelry, same as all the other times, same ring, same hoops, same everything. I'll promise I'll change it off in the next one. But anyways, this is what this outfit looks like. Super cute and I love it. So let's get on to our next place. Okay, so our next outfit is really simple. It's to Luna Park, which is in Sydney, super close to me. So basically, I just decided to pair it with this tight head top and some white shorts. Really simple, but I mean, when you go into Luna Park, you don't want to wear a skirt. I was contemplating doing a skirt, but I was like, hold on, that's like a theme park. You don't want to wear skirts to a theme park, but that's where we're going to get some exposure. Unless it's a tennis skirt or like a skirt. But anyway, this is what this outfit is, so let's try it on. Okay, so this is the outfit I chose for Luna Park. Super simple, but I feel like it's something good to wear to a theme park. You get hot when you're running around. So shorts and a crop top, I feel like fits well. I also just put my hair in a ponytail because when you're going on rides, your hair goes everywhere. I feel like you just need to have that up. But anyways, once again, would pair it with my Jordans, but I'm too lazy. But I mean, pair it with whatever you like. Then I have this bracelet. I have the ring, the hoops. I don't know if you're allowed to wear jewelry on rides, so... <laughs> I'm just... I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Um, anyway, um, I also have this moon and star necklace. It is so cute. I'm obsessed with it. Like, it's so simple, but, like, adorable. Like, that is really cute. I love it. Anyways, that was this outfit. I'm obsessed with it, but let's get on into our next one. Okay, the next place we're going is Hawaii. I've actually been to Hawaii. I love it there. It's so chill. It's so beautiful. The beaches there are amazing. It's so sunny. But anyways, for this outfit, what I chose was this pink boob tube and this black mid-length skirt that's just a bit flowy. I feel like it's just comfy, casual, which really suits the vibe of Hawaii in my opinion. But anyways, let's get on into trying this one on. Okay, so this is my outfit for Hawaii. It's super comfy. I'm actually obsessed with it. I really like the vibe of this one. So this boob tube is from Ali, and this skirt is also from Ali. This skirt was bought quite a while ago. It's my mom's. I'm just currently wearing it because I thought it was super cute and matched well for this theme. So I don't know if they still have it in stock. If not, I'll try and find something super similar. But anyways, we have the same jewelry on as last time because I feel like this really matches the vibe of this outfit. But let me get the camera angle down so you can see this full length of the skirt. Okay, so this is what the skirt looks like. It's long on one side and short on the other side. It's like a slit, I guess. It's super cute though and so comfy. I'm obsessed, 100%. Love it. This outfit's super cute. Yeah, I hope you guys like it as well. But anyways, let's get on into our next outfit. Okay, so we are now going to the beach. This one, obviously, is pretty self-explanatory. I'm going to be wearing a red bikini because I feel like red is really pretty. And I just have this white throwover because I guess if you go to the beach, it's nice to have a throwover. I don't normally wear a throwover. 
I've said that word so many times, but we're gonna see how it looks. This is the first time for both of us, I guess. So let's try it on now. Okay, so this is what this one looks like. It's pretty cute, but I decided, I don't know if the red's going really well with like this overall. So I'm gonna change the color of the bikini and I'll get back to you. But this is what it looks like. If you guys are interested in it, that's what the back looks like. It's pretty full coverage. Um, it's super cute though. I still love this bikini. I just don't know if it's too much with this because it does have the detailing at the front. But I'm going to change out the bikini for a different colour and show you guys what it looks like. Okay, so I just switched it out to a white bikini. I feel like it matches a lot better. I feel like it just kind of goes in a little bit nicer because it's white on white. And I mean, like, it doesn't look too much then because it's not too many different colours. But yeah, this is what this one looks like. This bikini is also from Cup She. This is what the back looks like. It's pretty full coverage as well. I just thought I'd show that. But yeah, this one is super cute. And I feel like it would be super cute just to wear to the beach. Just chuck this on, you know. Looks really cute. Gives me really cute beach vibes. But let's get on into our next place. Okay, so this next place is also our final place that I'm going to be showing you guys today. I'm super excited because I actually enjoy this video. Okay, so I haven't actually been to Dubai. So I didn't know too much about it, but I'm just styling it to the best of my ability. If I got it wrong, I apologize. But I have this dress that has like a little sports neckline, I guess. And then I'm going to pair it with these shoes into the Jordans for once. I haven't actually worn these yet. They're from Kmart, $12. Um, there's some fluffy little slides. They look like slippers, but they have a hard bottom. Absolutely obsessed. They're so extra, but so cute. Then I also pair with some sunnies and a little mini bag. Trust me, it's going to be cute. Let me try it on and then I'll show you the full outfit. Okay, so this is our outfit for Dubai. Apparently, when I was doing my research, Dubai is a really rich country. Explains why I paired it with this super extra bag. I mean... I'm sure they wouldn't walk around in slides and socks, but you know what? I'm Emily, so I'm going to. But anyways, this dress is super cute, and I've just paired it with my Rwan necklace because I'm obsessed with it, the hoops, and this bag. I'll try and get a full body shot so you can see the shoes as well. But yeah, this is this outfit. Okay, so this is what it fully looks like. Once again, you still can't fully see it, so let me just stand up on here. That's a lie, I'm not going to stand up there, my fan's on. But yeah, this is what it looks like, super cute. Let me take off a shoe so you can see. How cute are they? How cute are they? Literally fluffy slides, I've always wanted them. They're so cute. That was all for this week's video, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to go like, comment and subscribe. Here are my social medias, I post a lot of behind the scenes and info of upcoming videos. And you also have more of a chance to be featured in my videos. Like in this one if you do follow those. Go follow a Siamese Instagram and check out their website as well. They're so lovely. I just want to mention again, if you do end up buying something from this brand, just know that a dollar of what you've purchased is going to Beyond Blue for mental health. So you're helping out as well as helping out a small business. It's a great brand to help out with. But anyways, I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys next week when I post. Bye guys!